Hello everybody on YouTube, Sonic Waffles here, and today you're watching a game of Free For All on the map Underground, and actually this game isn't that amazing, it's just a 30 and 6, but I did start the game late, in fact, I started it when it was already one third of the way completed, so I, I did do something a little bit different, but once again it's just a 30 and 6, probably could have done a little bit better if I didn't uh, decide to pick up someone's ACR and use their noob tubes, but hey, if you have the noob tubes, you might as well use them. So, today I wanted to talk about a uh, little something that I talked about, uh, oh, what was I thinking of shooting at people? I'm playing Call of Duty, I can't shoot at people who need a knife, but today uh, I was thinking about talking a little bit about free-for-all, because I haven't done that in a while, and I've already done, uh, I've already done a commentated round of free-for-all on uh, Underground, so I don't think I need to talk that much, but... It's the exact same tactic I use uh, for if I want guaranteed wins because I wanted to talk about free for all as a game mode because really you could rush like a complete moron and win the game because it's kill based and not KDR based. I've seen I've been beating people by people that go 30 and 35 and they win the game in like 30 three minutes and 30 seconds. But once again they're rushing like complete idiot, idiots and getting you know two kill streaks and stuff like that, which I'd say is just you know as unskilled as camping in a corner but whatever whatever you want to do anyways if you want a guaranteed win for free-for-all which doesn't exist but if you want the closest thing to it then I suggest you use this killstreak setup it's uh, I think it's the exact same use uh, the exact same that I used in my winning with randoms video which is just the UAV predator and attack helicopter because the same thing happens in free-for-all that happens in your random lobbies, you know, your mercenary or whatever. The same thing happens because when people see that chopper in the air, you want to be the first one with the chopper in the air because guess what? It is the one thing in Call of Duty that truly makes you have to think about what you're doing and make you do it differently. Just think about it. Whenever there's a chopper in the air, what do you do? You gotta think, oh, there's a chopper in the air, you know. It's loud, I can't hear anything, I've got to go inside, I've got to hide, and I'm going to get shot by the chopper, I've got to change classes when I die. There are huge amounts of information going through your brain just about this chopper, which is distracting, and you instantly play worse. Now, some people can ignore it, uh, unlike me, I can't, I mean, I just, I just can't ignore it. It's just, I use my headset too much for, for me to ever just ignore this big, loud piece of metal in the air. So, unfortunately, I shouldn't even have to shoot at that guy when he falls into second chance. Down to death streaks. Black Ops information was released today, which is actually... That's all the information about Free For All I wanted to cover. The, the game's almost over, in fact. Uh, I think my... my uh, once again, my chopper does quite, quite a bit of work right here. But anyways, Black Ops 2 videos were released today. You can go see them on Tabe's channel. I'm not going to upload them. Uh, well, first of all, because technically they're not mine. I think they were recorded by some player and leaked. I'm not sure how how Treyarch is doing that, but I can tell you right now just how, like, you know, in Modern Warfare 3, they're like, all right, we can't have Juggernaut and Marty Dom. You know, they're thinking, oh, we're going to fix Call of Duty 4 and then give it out as a game. And what end up happening, they end up forgetting about something else, like infinite ammo, infinite noob tubes, infinite... Uh, or just death streaks in general, not infinite death streaks, but it sure does seem like it. So, once again, they, they're they fixing stuff, but they're forgetting about one thing that made uh, Modern Warfare 2 really bad, which was recoil. I mean, Black Ops had plenty of recoil, but, I mean, you take a look at, I mean, some of these guns that I'm watching, oh, this guy gets wrecked. Uh, some of these video clips that I'm watching, there's just no recoil, and it's a shame because I know that this game's going to seem like some kind of futuristic... Not a Star Wars game because everything's like a laser rifle. But whatever. Quick little free for all commentary today because I've got a lot of work to do. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And as always, have a good one. <laughs> 